What's up guys, it's your boy Pogo Dad, and we're back at it because I'm a pack addict. And guys, today we've got this huge Sword and Shield Ultra Premium Collection, aka the $100 Doggy Box. But yes guys, I have anticipated opening this for a long time, but I've wanted to save it for the new year. I think we should bring in the new year with a bang. So we're gonna use this box to do it. And this box comes with a ton of stuff. You get two gold versions of the doggies, which are Zacian and Zamazenta. You get a whole bunch of stuff, 16 packs. We're gonna go through this entire box today. But guys, I got a new thing to open up stuff with. One of my friends back in the day gave me this. So I named it Ride or Die. So Ride or Die is gonna peel off the skin so we can get in guys <laughs> but yes guys i have really wanted to get into this box and i i've had it for about a month but i wanted to save it and what better time than our first real video of the year so let's get the plastic off because it's making my camera glare all over the place let's scoot this back and we'll take a look at this little cardboard insert there it is there's everything that comes inside this is what it should look like when it opens man i am super excited guys but yes i was able to get mine through the hydro pump pokey shop and i actually traded in bulk to get it man look at this this box is so elegant i really don't want to mix it up too much because i don't want the contents inside like banging around but i think this is the way it opens i think you want the pokeball on top and if i did my calculations right we should be able to open this with no problem here we go guys all right, there it goes, and it's opening. Oh, baby, that is so elegant, guys. I'll try to pick it up so you can see, but look at it. That gold and black, man. Gold and black, it, it sets it off real well. But guys, let's go ahead, let's get into this. Let's see what everything is inside. We'll go one drawer at a time. Okay, we got our rule book. We don't need to look at that. And here we go, we got the series player's guide. In here, it shows you know a bunch of stuff for the sword and shield, plus you get the list of the sword and shield promos. I'm actually collecting the whole set of promos, so I really needed this just you know, so I had like a checklist. We do have this, we got this from the Pokemon Center, and now we'll be getting these two today, so man, I'm excited. One we don't have is Special Delivery Charizard. That should be coming out hopefully pretty soon. And for the code card, I will give you half of the code card now. And you'll have to wait till later to get the other half. So we'll go ahead and stick this drawer back in. And we'll go one drawer at a time. So we get into this side. It says Zacian right here. Zamazenta. And let's see. Oh, there's our Zacian on top. Look at that. Oh, baby. After we go through everything, we will be opening these up. But let's, let's make sure we got everything. Okay, that is empty. And there we go, we got Zacian sleeves. I keep wanting to say Zamazenta. But yeah, it's got like a nice gold inside. And let's see what else we have. We got four sword and shield base set packs. We'll set that to the side. I guess this must have been what was in that bag. Our Zacian gold coin, and this thing is like heavy, man. It's like a like a huge dollar-sized uh, coin. But yeah, man, these coins are awesome. And then you got some dividers, so you can put these in there and divide your cards up. So that looks like everything in drawer number one. Let's go to the middle. And we got more packs, man. 16 packs total should be in here. So here we go. We got... Four Darkness of Blaze, and we have four Rebel Clash. I'm, I'm really excited to get into that Rebel Clash. And here are our dice. These are also solid metal, and they got like a gold plated tint to them. And here's the other ones. These are like a chrome color. They're not black. I think they're actually like a chrome. So those are awesome as well. More dividers, and our Poison and Burn counters. These are awesome too. I might have to set these up in the background eventually. All right, so that's everything in the middle. And now let's go to our last drawer where our Zamazenta should be. And look at it, it's right there on top, wow. Our Zamazenta Gold. We have pulled 
the uh, the gold version of this from Sword and Shield Base, but we haven't pulled Zacian yet. So yeah, man, the centering, it's a little bit thicker, but it seems like all of them are just a little bit thicker on this side, but hey, it's cool. We needed it for our promo binder, and of course, the coin isn't in its package. There's our Zamazenta sleeves, also with the gold. And our last four packs are the Vivid Voltage. Nice. So it looks like you get an art set of each set. And there is Zamazenta. Which way does he go? There it is. There's that Zamazenta. Nice gold coins. Definitely going to display these. And then you get some more dividers. And that's basically it. So... What are we gonna do first? We're gonna open up every one of these packs today. We're gonna to go Sword and Shield first. Then we'll go, we'll go in order of release. Then we'll do Rebel Clash, Darkness of Blaze, and then Vivid Voltage. All right, guys, go ahead. If this is your first time here, go ahead, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button because we're gonna to do tons of these openings this year. We're gonna go bigger and harder than 2020. So here we go. Let's go ahead. Let's get into our first pack, man. If we could pull a gold Zacian from this box, that's the last card I basically need except for the Rainbow Marnie. And we're not going to do a card trick today. We're just going to go straight through because we have 16 packs. All right, here we go, guys. We got a Silly Cobra, Yampa, Krabby, Reverse Clobopus, and a Musharna Regular Rare. All right, so we got these cards. There's your code. I will be doing the rest of that code for the box in just a little bit. All right, pack number two. Let's see how many hits we can get from this. We got 16 packs, and I, I just said that I wasn't gonna do that code trick, but I guess we're gonna do the code trick on this one. <laughs> All right, but yeah, I'll give the rest of that code in just a little bit. We'll give everybody a chance to be able to get that code. It, it's probably a pretty valuable code because I think you get a gold version of the Zacian and the Zamazenta with that code. Alright, we got a Chinchow, Diglett, Reverse Gossifleur, and a Holographic Oranguru. So there's our, our first hit, I guess you would say. We'll, we'll, we'll sleeve it up just so we can see how many hits we get from this box. Alright, our third Sword and Shield base set. But yes, I hope everybody's having an amazing day. I hope that your New Year's went well. Hope everybody stayed safe. We had a blast. We didn't do anything. <laughs> we chilled at the house. And then on New Year's Day, we had a live. Man, that live was crazy. And we ended up pulling the last card we needed from Champion's Path. So we don't ever have to open up Champion's Path ever again. But we are going to do like a send-off to, um, to Champion's Path. We'll probably do at least one more open. And we're, we're going to open up more over time. But we're not going to do like any big huge chases anytime soon, I guess, if that makes sense. Since we pulled every card from the set. Alright, let's see if we can get our first Ultra Rare. This is our last pack of Sword and Shield Base. Definitely let me know what you guys think of this box down in the comments. I would love to know what you guys think. I think it's amazing. The box is like elegant with all the black and the gold. I might have to put it in my background. It's so cool looking. But here we go. We got a Quillfish and another Hollow. So we got two Hollows out of Sword and Shield Base. Maybe we'll save our best pull for uh, Vivid Voltage. We'll get that B-Max Pikachu. All right, next up, Rebel Clash. Still need to get the Rainbow Boss's Order. If we can get that, that would be pretty awesome. But let's see what we can get. All right, Lightning Energy. Phalanx. Uh, we got a golden nugget. We have Magmar blowing blowing something. I don't know what it's blowing. Alright, like the Buzz, Squovit, Snover, Reverse Hatrim, and a Mr. Rhyme. Not a bad uh, regular rare to get. I think it's about a dollar or two. Alright, second pack of Rebel Clash. Here we go. Alright. We got a Leaf, we have Metacham, Pokeball, Pelipper, Bullaby, Dreepy, Creepy Dreepy, Galarian Yamask, Surskit, Reverse Pokeball, and a Zamazenta, <laughs> all right? So a non-hollow Zamazenta. All right, we'll take it. All right, come on. 
I want to see if we can get us a secret rare. A secret rare pull from this box would, would make my day right now. All right. We're also going to take another look at those gold cards. We'll get them out of the package because I'm, I'm going to be keeping those regardless, even if the centering's bad or whatever. We still need it for our promo binder. All right, we got a not to Hone Edge, Reverse Olina, and a Nine Tails V Full Art. I don't have this, so that is a good hit, man. Nine Tails. Pretty good card, too. Centering looks pretty decent. Man, that pops. That pops really good. We're going to have to stick this right here. Man, I love this box. Have I said how much I like this box? <laughs> All right, last pack of Rebel. Let's see what it do. Hope you guys are getting some awesome pulls from these codes. Here we go. We got a Lampant Halucha. All right, I got to get on camera. I wasn't looking. All right, we got a Litwick. It's lit. <laughs> Galarian Cursola. Binacool Scyther. Ooh, Reverse Magmortar. I know I needed this. I didn't have that. So that's a good addition. And a gold card. Yo. What? We got a Galarian Perserker gold. Oh, man. <laughs> That is a good hit, baby. That is a good hit. This is one of the top pulls for this set and one that I had not had on camera. We did pull it off camera. Now we have a gold Perserker from the gold doggy box. Let's go. All right, let's, let's, we're gonna fill up this whole background full of hits, guys. That is our goal. Oh man, that is hype. We got a gold card, guys. That is hype. All right, so if we don't get anything else, I'm happy with the box. You get, uh, what is it? You get 16 total packs, and I feel like that's around maybe $65 value right there. So you're you're getting those gold cards at a good deal. At least, at least that's what I think. I'm not sure what the value of those are. I'll have it up on the screen, but uh, I would say they're at least 20 bucks, man. Those are some nice gold card wow look at this pack i didn't do that poor poor marini what happened to marini all right we'll have to take marini off r.i.p to marini all right i don't know how that happened maybe when it was packaged but let's make sure that the rare didn't get messed up as long as the rare isn't messed up i think we can take that hit <laughs> Well, at least Marini took the hit anyway. All right, we got Cub Chew. Reverse Cub Chew. Didn't get this shiny in Pokemon Go. I'm a little bit sad about that. And Holographic Suicune. Okay, that's a nice holo to get. We'll take it. All right. So we've gotten three hollows and two pretty good hits. All right, let's see if we can get the Charizard VMAX. Or a gold Rillaboom bow. If we get a gold Rillaboom, that would be crazy too. I still haven't pulled that, so I need it for the collection. All right, here we go, guys. All right, we got a Yellhorn, Flaffy, Carnivine. I got so many bolt cards falling in my way right now. <laughs> All right, we got Phoebus, Purloin, Hippopotas, Reverse Furret, and a Star Raptor. All right, last pack, Charizard pack. I was able to pull the Charizard VMAX from a Charizard pack, and I think that happened twice. So let's see if we can make it happen for the third time. All right, ready, set, go. All right, that's a good signal. That's a good sign. We got that fighting Machamp energy on the front. All right, Wimpod, Bunnelby. I like Bunnelby's art. Toxel, Sinisty, Carablast, Reverse Clank. And a Mew V. Okay, not a bad card. A nice fan favorite right there is a Mew. All right, we'll take it. So we are filling it up. We still need to get like one more, one more good pull. Now we're into Vivid Voltage. We're not going to do the card trick on these guys. We're just going to go straight through. Let's see if we can get us an amazing rare. Can we get a Rayquaza, please? Reverse Charmander. I don't think I had that. Pikachu VMAX! Let's go! That is a hit. Alright, this box, this box has, has done it. 
it has done it and look at that you see that fighting energy i tell you every time i get a, a really good pull it's from a fighting energy let me get a sleeve let's get a sleeve for the pikachu we got the chunky chew not the rainbow but a nice pikachu v max wow we did it guys we hit some really good cards in this box but yes like i said i did get this box from the hydro pump pokey shop and i actually traded in my bulk to get this because there you can trade in bulk and you can get grading or you can uh, trade it in for new booster boxes or product so yeah if you want to do that i'll leave a link down in the description if you want to do that that's where i send my bulk and and it paid off we got this nice box all right reverse voltorb and a zara aura holographic all right we have two more packs what is your predictions you think we're going to get anything else should we leave pikachu to the end all right we'll we'll leave pikachu to the last but yes i hope you guys enjoyed this um we do i am going to try to get another one of these boxes to uh save for my collection but like i said they are super hard to find i've seen them one time in stores and that was the only time i've seen it and like I said, I had this one on the way, so I didn't want to pick it up. I should have done it because I haven't seen it since. But here we go. We got a Pika Peck, Reverse Clefairy, and an Executor Regular Rare. And here is the rest of that code right there. All right, guys. Last pack. I hope you guys enjoyed. After this, we will take a look at those gold cards. There you go. There's your code. Four to the front. Ready, set, go. We have a Go Goat, Feral Thorn, Dusclops, Vampy. Man, this box has been amazing. We got Electrike, Pine Co., Mud Bray, Reverse Zapdos, and our last rare is a Metagross Non Hollow. All right, guys, as promised, we're going to take these out. I did go ahead and sniff off the end so we could get them out easily but here we go we got our black and gold zama zenta v and wow it looks really good it does actually have texture you really can't see it that much it's a slightly off centered but as you can see i don't see any type of damage so it didn't get damaged in shipping which is a <laughs> which is good so let's go ahead and sleeve this one up and then we'll go ahead and take a look at our Zacian. But yes, I have not pulled the actual Zacian from Sword and Shield Base. So now, at least I will have this gold version until I do get to pull it. And yeah, you can actually see the texture on this one too. But yeah, these cards, I think, will, will go up in value one day. But yeah, no, no damage. So yeah, that's pretty good. But yes, my final thoughts are, I really, really love this product. With everything that it comes with, you get the metal dice, the metal coins, the sleeves, the box. Man, I think this is a, a really good product to buy. And I really highly suggest buying one if you can get one. But yes, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. And let me know, are you going to get one of these boxes? My opinion is, I would buy it. But yeah, that's going to do it for us today. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, go ahead, smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you guys in the next one.